day of the week really the first day of the week because Saturday is the Sabbath well it is what it is hmm. anyway <sighs> I don't even know where to begin with this story so I'm not. Um, where is this time at? Oh, three minutes. Cool. Um, so I went back in the studio. And. Um, and what was that entitled? I did that twice. I, oh, shit. Come on, Chris. What you doing? I was going to do part one and part two. Oh, it says. Oh, no, it says loud voice, but the voice wasn't loud. Um, I'm 26. Oh, shit. There's a lot going on in my mind right now, so bear with me. 26. Um, oh, yeah, that's right. I got to go to the, uh, I got to do that. Uh, so I got sort of sidetracked. <laughs> I got sort of sidetracked with my music. Um, I had an issue with my truck, and so I, I so I I got into the drop. Before I had an issue with the drop, I had a, or the truck, I had an issue with the drop. Basically, that's why I was doing shit, recording and stuff in the truck. 
keep in mind I got the Suburban. So I'm just, I just had to kick back and just get everything fixed right. Like, um, I went and installed this. I might have it changed because I told him I don't like the red light on it. I asked him, did he have a blue light on it? I mean, it is what it is. I mean, it, it, and it has nothing to do with no gangs or anything like that, you know. Um, but, so I just had that installed yesterday, that Pioneer. Um, so I'm recording in this again. Uh, but yeah, I mean, you know, life is very interesting. Um, and let's see, do I want to get off into that right now or not? What did I try to notice? What is that? Oh, what was that like? What is this? Well, I entitled this X. Well, <sighs> it's the 26th of November. 2017. I'm just gonna document this. You know what? I've been feeling some kind of way and shit. Um, but um, it's a good way. At the same time, it keeps me um focused, really on the prize, meaning life in a big way, not a trophy or a bag with a money sign on it block of gold this isn't that kind of game video off in this bitch lane <laughs> you know what crystal you start that shit but at the same time you stay in your space you stay in your lane you understand me and keep the pace ahead but you look like you're behind but you're really ahead because you ran around twice Type shit, and you're almost on them again. Okay, where's the time at? 7:24. Yeah, man. Uh, I'm just gonna listen to this music because it's the first time that I've been really able to do this, like in these vehicles. I. Oh, okay, must have went to the time machine. I said, I know the damn bank. I know the bank ain't open. Shit, I don't. Okay, so uh, anyway, um, yeah. Yeah, man, there's a lot going on. Um, there's a lot that I want to touch on also. Uh, to those out here that um, that may see, you know, or, you, you know, everybody's on the internet, I know that. Don't let people spook you out about extraterrestrials or beings coming here and doing things to people don't let them do that there's people as I, I i explained that a long time ago people have always been here like in earth beyond antarctica there's i i explained it what video no i'm not you know i was at home depot that morning what video was that I explain that it's all coming out now, but I explain that because you know you astral plane and you go see, you see that. So don't and I see how people may be trying to play on it. People knew about this shit a long time and how they're trying to play on it. Um, don't be you know, and I know, man, people are so into this shit. Like you know, this car, that's a, I got a private jet. Oh, this or that, they see something different or something materialize in front of them they'll lose their damn mind yeah so um there's a lot that i really want to touch on i just got back into my listening session but i did get back into the studio okay I did get back into the studio and do some stuff, but the same day, the next day, the next day when I went, oh, that's why I want to address these raggedy ass streets in Milwaukee. Where is this time at? Y'all got to fix these bitches. Like, really, fix these damn streets. 
It claimed two of my vehicles. And this one, I got like a little ball joint problem on in the front. So, you know, you're doing good. You know, uh, kudos to you fixing 90th Street. You got to get 43rd Street fixed. And I'm talking about from the big ass statue with the man on the horse, Lisbon, all the way down, damn it, to Brown Deer. Fix that shit. Like, get 51st fixed. You're fit working on it now and fix 60th. Especially when you come off like from Hampton. By that gas station. That shit is raggedy as hell, man. And you catch running around here with these big ass rims and these little ass tires and you fucking your shit up and you got your music loud where you cannot hear the damage that these streets are doing on your vehicle. Like, I know. I mean, I, I, I've been knowing that I've been having problems in the streets and dodging potholes and stuff like that. But when this when this radio went out, I really heard shit. It was nerve wracking, like really, when you didn't have anything to listen to. So fix these streets. Let me see why I'm on there. Which other one? I don't want any of the avenues I drive on that have fucked up roads. I'm serious. I'm serious. I'm not. I don't want to pay a ten dollar wheel tax and then still have you tear my shit up. And I know it's big business. I know it's big business because the money goes into the money machine. You have um, shops, you have, um, you know, uh, mechanics or whatever else. And you have all that stuff that goes into Wisconsin because they got to pay taxes. They got to buy parts. It's big fucking business, but get these streets together. Really enough's enough. And that's the truth. Um, and there was a lot of things that piled up, but I was like, I got, was like on a timeout, like, I was on a timeout and just really had to meditate on, on all of this. Now, I'm not totally blaming the city of Milwaukee for having these streets like this. But I told you all a long time ago, you just can't feel holes. And I know it's a temporary fix. Well, if that's the case, get that real shit and fill the holes with. Get that real shit with a bonding agent on it. And I know about masonry, masonry work. Like... And, and there's no disrespect to the cities because the shit is politics. The city workers, they don't have anything to do with it. But I'm going to tell you like this. If if you get in a check and someone say, hey, just go shovel the shit in and let people roll over. Well, you go shovel it in and let people roll over and get your check. Like, hey. But still, enough on that. Shit. Now, where is that? 1250. Also, um... Nelson, Nelson Plumbing. I, you know, I didn't even want to bring this up at all. Uh, I grew up with Rick, Paula, Nelson, uh, Roy, and wife, family. We we grew, we all grew up together. Um, so don't be fucking with them, like really. Don't be pulling contracts and shit from them because of what happened uh, Roy, to Roy. R I H. Um, because they are more than capable of running that business. Leave them the hell alone. Like, really, leave them the hell alone. Don't be fucking with the contracts and doing underhanded shit now. Do not do that. At least see shit happen. But you don't do that before you see if, that someone can't handle the business. You just don't start doing that. So, so cut that shit out. Um... It was also something else that I wanted to tap on or speak on. And there's just a lot going on in my mind right now. Um, I have two trucks down and uh, they're going to be, they're, go they're, they're, they're being taken care of. Put it like that. But I have two trucks down. I'm in my vehicle. Fix these fucking streets. Real talk. Um, and also, if you start seeing things, don't be paranoid. Don't let no one tell you that um, that there are, you know, that that, th that that beings are hostile in other places. This shit could have been happened if that's the case. No one's doing that. Just go back, go into your mind. Actually, you're gonna know because when you see. Now, I don't know everybody. Like you, you may have some. There might be something that they don't know they are. You know, there there may have to be a sweeping. I I don't know. You know, I, I I'm not I'm not going to even say 
is what I'm saying. But believe me, you, you go back into your old Negro spirituals and swing low, sweet chariot and all this stuff. They knew we ain't, we ain't, we're, we're not, we don't listen to those kind of musics anymore. And a lot of times I try to bring it in a way where, um, where people can hear it and still know, uh, in, 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 in the here and now form, put it like that. Um, I'm going to put this straight on, uh, Facebook. I just got a very important text. I'm going to take care of some things, but yeah, um, yeah, y'all keep y'all hands up to see shit coming one. I'm out.